Brendan the world changed after 2020. Yeah. Yeah. Um, when we were told that uh, we have this COVID, and because of this COVID, um, there is going to be a lockdown. Um, initially, even before they spoke about the lockdown, mm. the president said, nobody will be forced to take the vaccine. You remember that? Yeah, yeah. Nobody will be forced to take the vaccine. Correct. Along the way, they decided, no, there must be mandatory vaccinations mm -hmm. in the country. I stood up in parliament. I said to the president, God wants everybody to be saved. Yeah. And yet, he does not impose his salvation on everybody. He gives human beings a choice. choice yeah. Free will. Free will. Yeah. Okay? I said, it would be wrong for you, for government to do what even God is not doing. Mm. People must have a choice. Mm. Nobody must be forced. Those who don't want it, they must not be forced. Yeah. And those who want it should take it. Sure. So government stopped with the mandated vaccinations because of ACDP. Thank you so much. All right. Some of us never jabbed. It's from <laughs> ACDP. Yeah. Let's see. Did you jab? No. Ark. No, 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 oh, yeah, 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 no. Yeah, I yeah, never yeah, jab yeah. and I will never. Covered in the cloak. Yeah. Come on. Uh, yeah. Okay. Never. I will never do that. And then they spoke about mandatory vaccinations for children. Yes. We went to court. ACDP went to court. Yeah. And said this would be wrong. Yeah. And uh, we had an urgent application that, to that took more than six months. Mm. It was urgent. That could have been done within days yeah. or weeks maximum. Yeah. But they were avoiding. Yes. Why? Because they wanted to do it. Mm. And because, again, of ACDP, no child in South Africa has been forced and will be forced to take the jab. So I think all the guys here mm. need to say thank you to the ACDP. No, I'm saying on their behalf. Yeah. The sure. good reverend. Thank you so much. Um, yeah. I lost my father February 2020. I think he's the reason we were locked down because that guy. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Anyways, we lost my father in February 2020 and then March we were locked down. And it was a very, very tumultuous two years. A lot of clashing views. Some of the voices we were trying to raise on social media, some of the questions we were trying to raise were shut down, mm. including some of these platforms we use today. And it, yeah. it, was, it was very sad. And to see people like yourself rising up at that time and, and speaking proudly and defending not Christians, Correct. You weren't defending a certain group. You weren't defending ACDP mm. voters. Mm. You were mm. saying every human being, we just happen to have a voice here in South Africa mm. and, and in the government, but every human being should be allowed to have choice. Correct. And you made sure that we fought because we don't know where we'd be today with some of the, the horror stories that we've heard afterwards. Yeah. Uh, of, of what has happened since. But from my side, thank you so much. You, you, know, you know that the, the World Economic Forum is now talking about a permanent lockdown permanent now nobody's well maybe not correct most people are not going the majority of people are not going to survive if you have a permanent lockdown no business we are going to lose our jobs we're going to lose our houses we're going to lose our assets we're going to lose our livelihoods permanent lockdown you'll be told you can't visit your mother who's sick in limpopo Many of us bur buried loved ones that we never got to see. Right. Now, we have experienced that. Now, ACDP, this is going to be one of the issues we'll be raising during campaigning. Mm. Other political parties have been given money. They are being sponsored. This is a real thing? You're confirming now? Yeah. Yeah. I confirm this. There are many, a few, well, let me say there are a number of newer political parties. Mm that they have more money than us. Hmm. Why? Because when these guys give you millions, there are strings attached. Hmm. What do you give back? Okay. You have to One make sure that when it's time to vote certain things in. Yeah. All right. When Mishwe will be saying, we, ACDP says no permanent lockdown. Yeah. They will not be saying we support him. Because those who give him them money, expect them to support what their agenda. There is an evil agenda, must say to you, sir. 
What, what, is, what is the rationale that the, the World Economic Forum is using for a permanent lockdown? Do you know? Well, some of us, well, because there are too many people on Earth <laughs> and climate change. <laughs> they are fighting climate change. And some of us are called the useless eaters. So, that is South Africa. They must start with Africans. They are not contributing to the world economy, they are saying. You know, I want to I wanna dispel this because a lot of people still believe in this thing of overpopulation, etc. If you ever go and look at the data online, you can go on Google, you can go and research. Luckily, they haven't started lying about that. Mm. Human beings occupy about one to one and a half percent of arable land on the planet. If you were to take all human beings and put them side by side together, we would occupy the city of Los Angeles only. All eight to 11 billion, whatever number you want to use. Put all of us side by side, we would only be in one city on the is it the west coast is it the west coast mm. los angeles west coast yeah mm. that's us that's yeah. how much land we have now south africa for people who are like oh, we overpopulated squatter camps if you ever get a chance take a bus take a taxi drive fly it's even easier around to fly. around south yeah. africa move from johannesburg mm -hmm. to where mm -hmm. i come from in newcastle and just look mm. at the land mm. it is it is a myth and it's a lie it's a lie it definitely is a lie now, obviously, Bill Gates is the one who's pushing this. Yarr, dropping the names now. Yeah, no, no, no it's yeah, fine. It's Bill Gates, he's he's driving the myth and the lie mm. that there are too many people on overpopulation. Earth. <laughs> and we are the target. That's why I don't understand our African. Many African leaders, I think, are cowards. Many African leaders are cowards. Cowards or just greedy. Because maybe both, they, maybe both. they brave maybe they brave but they choose money but over bravery. Well, it is possible. Yeah. But how can you be quiet when people say Africans are useless eaters? I will speak for my people. I'm not a useless eater. Donald Trump called us a shithole. <laughs> Excuse my French. <laughs> now th 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 there's a dispute about that. Mm -hmm. That whether he wrote that. There are people. Trump. Yeah, there's a dispute <laughs> about that. I have not said anything about that one, but I'm sure. speaking about the one, the video I've seen. Useless eaters. Yeah. We produce nothing. Mm. We all, don't... All, the, all the trial meds and all those things must be started there. Yeah. All the, now we're speaking renewables and those things of which all the first world nations have built their economies using fossil fuels. We and, have the coal. And, and we are and not allowed to use We are being told, fuels. don't do not do that. And our president who should be a lawyer, an educated person buys into that. 